This video is about the Filipino's favorite snack, the banana cube. We are here right now in Mactan Island and we just happened to see this lady here just cooking banana cube and like every Filipino's knows and likes banana queue. I don't know someone that don't like banana queue. You know, because this is Sorry, our favorite it, it. favorite snack here in the Philippines. They come in different variety. They got like um like they called pinay pai, like uh, the banana is sliced like fingers, like like fan. That's why it's called pinay pai. Pila ang kuanti? Ten. Ten ang tuhog. So 10 pesos, 5 pesos per banana and it's all caramelized with brown sugar. And the best way to eat it is during snack time and it's very hot. Uh, that's what we prefer. You know, hot banana queue. Asa sa ka mga pasagin te? Asa sa sa sa. Ha? Just muntay ganyo na han ka mga market. So he's just by the banana supply here around the same area in Mactan. So he's cooking banana here every day? So he, she works inside Maktan Shrine, 6 to 2, and then 2 o'clock she's cooking her banana queue business. Pila say mo makita sa kaadlaw ti? O kusog yun ka ng mga weekend, no? Kana. So, so Saturday, Sunday, because there's a lot of visitor in the Mactan Shrine, she, her banana business is booming. So, mga makaginan siya sa kanig mga dos mil, tres mil, ti. Adi, po ka daadlaw? Ah, adi, ka ng Domingo, Sabado. Adi, Sabado. Aha, mga pilar. Aginan siya naman good, no? Mga libo, dos mil, no? Adi, ka ang So that's what her sideline, as well as she's working inside the shrine. I think they're caretakers of the shrine, and then this one, she uh, 500 to 1000 pesos profit. Profit, pugihan kay kati niya maglaw trabaho pa kati niya magpuan. Mong mga anak tidi manabang ti pila ka buok. So she got four girls. Pero na pa kay Banati. And her husband. Imong husband, no? Ay, guapo mo sa dining husband ate. So this is ate's husband here. So this is their sideline business. Aside from both of them are working. So that's banana queue. You put on the brown sugar. And... How do you know it's okay na pa sa ono? When you have it caram caramelized, when it starts melting and sticking to the bananas, that's when you pick it up and then put it on a bamboo stick, bamboo stick like that, or like that one I have. And you eat it hot with a cold soft drinks. A cold cold soft drinks. So that's that's how like the patanaw na so that's now ready na natin. So you can see it's ready when all the sugar is melted and sticking to the bananas. I like when my banana is like it's ripen na. This one. Ripen? Yeah. Oh uh, yeah, like, people like it when it's really ripe because uh, it's sweet. So Ate here and her husband are working together in their sideline business. Mm -hmm. That's how it's looked like. So that's the bananas. It should not most of it like um half ripe, ha half green, but some prepares it really ripe because it's sweet. But the thing is, if it's really ripe, it's also absorbing a lot of oil. So like Atis husband is the one doing the Change giving and collecting the cash. Oh, in your hand, in the hand, eh? 
Oh. So that's also her friends friends um shop so they go back to back side by side beside the shrine selling snacks so that's the banana queue filipinos favorite snack I'm sure a lot of you, my Filipino brothers and sisters abroad, especially if you're living so long in America or anywhere, any country, you are missing this. Like, oh, I miss the banana queue.